South African Trade Unions, Kosati Long Live. Long Live. Long Live the South African National Civic Organization, Sanko Long Live. Long Live. Long Live the South African Student Congress, Sasko Long Live. Long Live. Long Live the Congress of South African Students, Kosasi Long Live. Long Live. Long Live Long Long Live. Long Live Long Live. Long Long Live. Long Live Long Live. Long Long Live. Long Live 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 Long Live. Thank you, Comrade Chair, um, and greetings to the second uh, GS, Comrade Soli. <coughs> oh, first, I apologize. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> I apologize, Comrade Soli. Yes, the first GS, Comrade Soli, my pile. Uh, the <coughs> provincial secretary, Comrade Bonagela Machuba, and the other members of the PC, members of the provincial committee of the Young Communist League, and the delegation of the African National Congress led by Ukomrete Devusi Shome, uh, members of Kosatu, leadership of Kosatu, and the leadership of Sango. All protocol observes, Comrade. The, thank you very much for affording us the opportunities, the Young Communist League, to present our message to this important lecture that remembers an important son of South Africa, a communist, a founding member of the Young Communist League, and a leading contributor to reviving and the rebuilding of the Young Communist League to be a potent weapon in the hands of the working class, broadly. But more specifically, an important leader who played an important role in defining and shaping our understanding of what it means to be united in the current context of our revolution. And it is against this backdrop that I wish to use this opportunity, Chair, to speak on this important point, which seems to have dominated in the political discourse of late, the centrality of unity as a weapon of struggle. We converge today, mindful of the fact that we discuss this name, no bala, but let me mention this, we converge today in the same week where we commemorated the life of another important son of Africa and South Africa, Ustibin Bandu Bigo, a day after we've laid to rest yet another important son of Africa, a contemporary of ours in the form of the 24th African National Congress Youth League Secretary General, Ukomret Singh Disomakak. As the Young Communist League, we wish to extend our heartfelt condolences to his family. Contemporaries in the ANC Youth League who worked with him and his counterparts in the African National Congress and the broader movement who shared the deep pain of his loss. But more importantly, comrades, we also converge a day after what the ANC Youth League has, ANC, let me correctly put it, has correctly characterized is a watershed preferential general council. This provincial general council echoes a sentiment which we also saw being presented at the funeral of Sindhi Somakata. That speaks of unity. Like many others in the movement, we are pained by the disunity, the fragmentation of the people's camp, and the general political and organizational disarray, which has blunted our ability to advance our, our political mission as a movement broadly. And the sharpening of these contradictions have brought us to the point where we as the Young Communist League specifically have raised vehemently the call that perhaps it is opportune and in fact prudent for the South African Communist Party to consider exercising an alternative form of contesting power through a reconfigured alliance by, by directly contesting elections. All of these factors, including the death of Magata, including the posture of the South African Communist Party, as exemplified by our position as the Communist League, point to the pain that we feel as a movement. In this response, given this response, Many of the leaders have correctly pointed out that there has to be a genuine effort to unite the movement. 
and the sensible components of the movement, it seems logical that we should support this call. But before we do so, and again at the risk of seeming as if we are uh, um, uh, so losers, as it were, or not in the uh, not uh, acting in, co in, in in not flowing, non full, I'm on full we think it necessary that we bring to open a discussion about what we mean when we talk about unity. What is the form and content of this unity that we talk about? And perhaps in doing so, we must perhaps start by defining what unity is not before we get to what unity is. Firstly, our conceptualization of unity is that unity is not the same as conformity. We should go to Uma cities united, as he should see a fan. That's the first thing. Unity is also not the absence of hostility. We go to Uma Kuma to Jolan, I wish we would say unity. And the last element of how we conceive unity is that unity is not an event, it's a process. So taking all of these elements into account, we accept that there has to be an ongoing process, a political process of finding each other in the best interest of the movement. But that process should not circumvent the natural process of trying to establish the basis upon which this unity should be forged. Uma city gune unit and it's city unity foot I see event. City E unity foot Iona a pact that exists among the elite at the exclusion of the masses. But this is what comrades are saying. That is not unity. Unity is fought through a communion that exists between the leaders and the masses. Not through a pact that is signed in corners there where people are paraded in front of the masses and then we are forced to believe that is unity. Unity is not an event, it's a process. <coughs> Given this conceptualization, we then say, the basis upon which we should forge this unity that is in the interest of the movement should be programmatic in action. So like every other component of, move, of the movement, we maintain our position that we accept that there has to be a process where we find each other. And indeed, the efforts that have been made thus far should be welcomed. But that process should be underpinned primarily by a process of uniting the interest of the people first and foremost before the interest of the elites and the leadership. This is our position on the matter. All right. You see, Angiaga City United, Namsanja Makaban, says the Nati Mansisko Shagwanko wins a lady. Angi, while we may be young, but we are not born today. And an attempt that would seek to unite the organization based on a weak foundation. La guzo ba kwa nama tisiji na zotatwa with sese fu mela nage emanye. Squash boe bo mke sog is a process that is doomed to fail in Makabani. Nga lao ma ze siti Makabani, let us take from the queue of Comrade Dikeg, who was a tireless campaigner for e unity of the movement and embodiment of the unity of the movement in all its forms. But primarily, one of the legacies of Cambridge Cathy was that he understood that the unity of the movement is based on action and is based on a process or on the outcome. over a lifetime. Nalo mazimakabani bestele guti niskulu renati niwa zuguti ni demte bomoche si shoje si yankomnisli guti njengo basa shilo. 
Nazi se afunu wen nganya le unity. Nazi se afunu bizo stages babi zanja. Bonaga lutisi nganya le unity. Sponga kulma kabani. Thank you very much.